pretty tacky like a lip gloss as you guys can see it's really tacky 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 rumba okay, you guys didn't hear that right Hey everyone, welcome back to my channel. Thank you so much for joining me on this next adventure here on the channel. And I do want to say sorry for not uploading my videos as promised on time. Just because of some circumstances where I had family over from a whole different country. And she didn't leave until yesterday. And then I had another aunt come in. So I was tied up pretty much with work as well. It's just adult life, man. And it's really hard. I'm not going to lie to you guys. So I did flim all of this on time. It's just the matter of me sitting down to editing was kind of a little difficult. And I do apologize. Sincerely, sincerely apologize from the bottom of my heart. But anyhow, let's get on with this video. And today's video is a very special video. I do want to say thank you to Misha Canada for sending me the contest prize value up to $60. I appreciate the most. I'm really familiar with Isn't Misha Canada. Some of the products are really amazing. They're really rejuvenating when it comes to the skincare line, as well as their eyeliners, mascaras. They're very durable, very, very worth it. So to enter the contest and be able to be a winner is amazing, and I really do appreciate it. So today we're going to go over some of the contents in there, and yeah, so let's get on with it. So first up, in the box, we have... This beautiful nail polish. It is a really, really blood red color. It's beautiful. It's really, really cute. Um, unfortunately, I didn't get to see the name of the color, but it just says Misha on there, and it's just a red. So I got a nail polish. That's the first item. The next few items we're gonna start with is gonna be um, makeup and then we're gonna get into a little bit of skincare. So some of the makeup items that I did get um, happens to be a cotton contour um, powder. So this is the item right here. As you can see, it's a little bit almost to the same color or true color to my skin. So I don't know how well that's gonna work with the contouring for me, but I'm gonna try to work it in as a shadow base color or even um, a um, how would you call it not a highlight but more of a concealing color for like some areas of my skin so that's gonna be great to have we're gonna try that out and then we're gonna move on to stick shadows so i was really blown away by this one product and it's a dual if i can find it it's a dual um cushion shadow so at the both ends if you want to take a look right there both ends of the product uh, so yeah, the product with the stick has eyeshadow that's like the powder's kind of crushed in and then the cushion's like stuck in there like this And then when you pop it out, you can just go like this and it's literally there So I actually have some here on my eye. I don't know if you can see like a tiny little bit amount and Yeah, secondly, we got the contour fit stick shadow in a baby pink color So I got some already already on my eye if you guys can see if I could zoom up enough There you go. You can see it's like a very light pink color. It blended very, very well in. I cannot keep my eyes closed. I don't know what's going on, guys. I don't know what's going on with me. I don't know if I have the jitters or if I ate chocolate too much or drank a lot of water. I'm all over the place. I'm so sorry. So yeah, that product really blends in very well. It's not sticky. It's not tacky. It's not powdery. It's like a crayon. You just rub it on and just go. It's simple as that. And then the next product for your face happens to be a lip gloss. Um, it's called Marry You Pearl in Love Gloss. Um, the color is this very sparkly pink color. Very pigmented. Um, it is a gloss to remind you. So it's very tacky. Um, so it's not a lip stain or lip color to be like always on here and you go like this. It's going to be there. It's going to be like coming off like that. But um, it's very moisturizing, so I'm excited to use that. And that's the shade. It's super, super sparkly. Yeah. And then we're going to move on to the skincare line. So the skincare line that I've gotten um, is for sensitive skin, which I do, do, do have. And I do take caution of using products. So I really don't want to break out all of a sudden or throw off my pH levels. So I'm happy to start using this whenever I can or whenever my, like 
skincare routine kind of dies down and I can switch over for a new product. I'm going to try this. It is from Simply Therapy Skincare for Sensitive Skin and it's a finishing cream. So this is probably like one of the last items you're going to probably use um, after doing your 11 steps of Korean skincare, which I do do. So if you can take a look, if the camera's not shaking or if I am not, I'm going to try turning it sideways. There we go. And that's a finishing cream, so I'm looking forward to that. It's this generous, generous, generous tube, and I'm probably going to use this as if it was Tylenol, like a little bit, like a little quantum. So yeah, that's one part of the skincare. And then we have these last two things for skincare, and this happens to be the vitamin B12 um, drop hydro miniature kit. So this one here um, is amazing. I'm probably going to use this for sure when I'm breaking out or prone to be breaking out we have an ampoule there and then we have a cream over here to help soothe your skin and provide wrinkle care and brightening um whenever is best so that's something i'm looking forward to using whenever i can to get rid of some pop-up acne that's happening here that i really wish didn't happen but it's gonna go boom when i get this on there so that's something I'm interested in. And as well as this, it's called the Time Revolution uh, Trial Set. So in here is another ampoule. And then it's going to be a toner and a essence. So these are mostly for night stuff. So I'm excited to use this for a trial of a bedtime. Just to help when I wake up in the morning, my skin's a little bit more plump, a little bit more soft, and refreshed. So I'm looking forward for this part of skincare. And finally, we have reached the very last few items of the box. And I love face masks. I think I'm a face mask quarter, to be honest. Because I think I've collected masks from Korea, from New York, from Canada, from Misha, from Ipu, from like so many like brands, companies, um, places and i just keep getting them all these kinds and i'm pretty sure they're gonna expire soon so i'm gonna have to start wearing a sheet mask for like every night and every morning but no one can say you know enough sheet masks so these are the sheet masks that i did get and i was thrown oh like thrown or blown away by this one the potato one i have never seen a nisha or a any face fashion in matter of fact this potato properties i know potato properties are really good for you um when you get burns for brightening for potassium and all that great stuff so this being on your skin i'm looking forward to you i'm hoping i don't smell like a potato after this but never know so i'm looking forward to this potato mask as well as these two um soldier mind soothing combo camo mask these two masks as well um at the back the instructions are there um but i feel like it's for a guy just because um there's a guy at the back that's putting on a face mask but hey face masks are not gender bias so we're gonna wear all of these and get our skin beautifully refined so once again thank you so much to misha canada for sending me this beautiful package it means a lot to me and if you guys didn't have a chance check out misha canada page for some new news new products new discounts maybe and stuff like that i am no way sponsored by them but um if you guys are looking for a sponsor person shout out to your girl over here with mine um but yeah thank you guys so much for watching my video and it's a pleasure seeing you guys again and don't forget to check out my next few videos that involve my nct kino album as well as the neo city anyways guys thank you guys so much bye Get our potato mask on and see you K dreamers later.